Let's talk about anatomical position and answer the questions, what is the anatomical position and what role does it play in anatomy and healthcare? Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Morton and I am the noted anatomist. First question is, how would you describe the location of the yellow circle? Oh, it's on the front of the hand. Now, how would you describe the location of the yellow circle? Well, it's on the inside of the hand. Isn't that just the front of the hand, but it's facing in? How would you describe the location of the yellow circle? Oh, it's on the front of the thigh. No, it looks like it's on the top of the thigh to me. Isn't it still the front, but it's facing up? How would you describe the location of the yellow circle? Oh, it's on the top of the forearm. No, that's the back of the forearm. Isn't that the same thing? Can you see the conundrum early anatomists faced, conundrum, good word, when trying to describe direction and position in the human body? The description changed each time the position of the body changed. What is the solution? One standard position. We call it the anatomical position. Now, what does it consist of? As this photograph shows, the patient's facing forward, arms down at the side, palms facing forward with the thumbs pointing out and the radius and ulna are parallel to each other. The right and left are from the viewpoint of the patient, not the observer. The patient's position does not matter. It, the directional terms are always described with regards to this anatomical position. A couple of things, that's the front of the hand or the palmar surface, and that's the back of the foot or the dorsal surface, the part that touches your shoelaces. What you stand on the ground is actually the ventral surface of your foot or the plantar surface. Now, why is this anatomical position important? Describe that mole. Well, it is on the back of the right hand. Describe the location of that scar. It's the back of the left knee joint. Describe these two scars from carpal tunnel release. That's the front of the right wrist, and that's the front of the left hand. How about this scar? Well, that's on the dorsal and lateral surface of the right foot. Directional terms are always described with regards to this anatomical position. And that, my friends, is the anatomical position in a nutshell.